Happy Feast of the Visitation of the Blessed Virgin Mary on this, the 2nd of July. The readings will come from the Canticle of Canticles, chapter 2, verses 8 to 14, and Luke 1, 37 to 47. And so let's begin. In nomine Patris, et Filii, et Spiritus Sancti. Amen. From the Canticle of Canticles The voice of my beloved, behold, he cometh leaping upon the mountains, skipping over the hills. My beloved is like a roe or a young heart. Behold, he standeth behind our wall, looking through the windows, looking through the lattices. Behold, my beloved speaketh to me, arise, make haste, my love, my dove my beautiful one, and come. For winter is now past, the rain is over and gone. The flowers have appeared in our land. The time of pruning is come. The voice of the turtle is heard in our land. The fig tree hath put forth her green figs. The vines and flower yield their sweet smell. Arise, my love, my beautiful one, and come. My dove in the clefts of the rock, in the hollow places of the wall, show me thy face, let thy voice sound in my ears, for thy voice is sweet and thy face comely. Deo gratias. Continuation of the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. Gloria tibi Domine. Because no word shall be impossible with God. And Mary said, Behold the handmaid of the Lord, be it done to me according to thy word. And the angel departed from her. And Mary, rising up in those days, went into the hill country with haste into a city of Judah. And she entered into the house of Zachary and saluted Elizabeth. And it came to pass that when Elizabeth heard the salutation of Mary, the infant leapt in her womb, and Elizabeth was filled with the Holy Ghost. And she cried out with a loud voice and said, Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb. And whence is this to me that the mother of my Lord should come to me? For behold, as soon as the voice of thy salutation sounded in my ears, The infant in my womb leapt for joy. And blessed art thou that hast believed, because those things shall be accomplished that were spoken to thee by the Lord. And Mary said, My soul doth magnify the Lord, and my spirit hath rejoiced in God my Savior. Laus tibi Christi. 